Hello, welcome to the Daily Office. Thank you for joining me. This is Evening Prayer for Sunday, February the 19th. It's year two. It's the last week after Epiphany before the beginning of Lent, and it's week two in the Psalm cycle. The scriptures for this service, Psalms 114 and 115. Sirach, or Ecclesiasticus, chapter 48, verse 1 through 11, and the Song of Mary. O God, come to my assistance, make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia, when Israel came forth from Egypt, Jacob, Leah, and Rachel's family. Alleluia, Psalms 114 and 115. When Israel came forth from Egypt, Jacob, Leah, and Rachel's family from an alien people, Judah became God's temple and Israel became God's kingdom. The sea fled at the sight, the Jordan turned back on its course, the mountains leapt like rams, and the hills like yearling sheep. Why was it, see, that you fled, that you turned back Jordan on your course? Mountains that you leapt like rams, hills like yearling sheep. Tremble, O earth, before God the Most High, in the presence of the God of Jacob, Leah, and Rachel, who turns the rock into a pool and flint into a spring of water. Not to us, O God Most High, not to us, but to your name give the glory for the sake of your mercy and your truth, lest the heathen say, Where is their God? But our God is in the heavens, and whatever God wills, God does. Their idols are silver and gold, the work of human hands. They have mouths, but they cannot speak. They have eyes, but they cannot see. They have ears, but they cannot hear. They have nostrils, but they cannot smell. With their hands they cannot feel, and with their feet they cannot walk. No sound comes from their throat. Their makers will become like them, and so will all who trust in them. Israel's family, trust in God the Most High. God is your help and your shield. Aaron's family, trust in God the Most High. God is your help and your shield. All you who fear God the Most High, trust in God the Most High. God is your help and your shield. God the Most High remembers and will bless, will bless the family of Israel, will bless the family of Aaron. God will bless those who fear God, the little no less than the great. To you may God grant increase, to you and all your children. May you be blessed by God the Most High, the maker of heaven and earth. The heavens belong to you, O God, but to us you have given the earth. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word, and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. When Israel came forth from Egypt, Jacob, Leah, and Rachel's family. Alleluia. The lesson is from the book of Ecclesiasticus, chapter 48, beginning at verse 1. And then Elijah arose, a prophet like fire, and his word burned like a torch, and he brought a famine upon them, and by his zeal he made, a, made them few in number, and by the word of the Lord he shut up the heavens, and also three times brought down the fire. How glorious you were, Elijah, in your wondrous deeds, whose glory is equal to yours. You raised a corpse from the death, and from Hades, by the word of God the Most High, you sent kings down to destruction, and famous men from their sick beds. You heard rebuke at Sinai, and judgments of vengeance at Horeb. You anointed kings to inflict retribution, and prophets to succeed you. You were taken up by a whirlwind of fire in a chariot with horses of fire. And at the appointed time it is written, you are destined to calm the wrath of God before it breaks out in fury, to turn the hearts of parents to their children 
and to restore the tribes of Jacob, Leah, and Rachel. Happy are those who saw you and were adorned with your love, for we also surely shall live. Here ends the lesson. And now let us offer our prayers and petitions. Show us your mercy, O God, and grant us your salvation. Clothe your ministers with righteousness. Let your people sing with joy. Give peace in Jerusalem and in all the world, for only in you can we live in safety. Keep this nation in your care. Guide us in the way of justice and truth. Let your way be known upon the earth and your saving health among all the nations. Let not the needy, O God, be forgotten, nor the hope of the poor taken away. And create in us clean hearts, O God, and sustain us by your Holy Spirit and for all of your intentions. Our beloved which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Magnificat anima mea dominum. The Song of Mary. My soul proclaims your greatness. Magnificat anima mea dominum. My soul proclaims your greatness. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior, for you have looked with favor on your lowly servants. From this day all generations will call me blessed. You have done great things for me. Holy is your name. You have mercy on those who fear you in every generation. Magnificat anima mea dominum. You have shown the strength of your arm. You have scattered the proud in their conceit. You have cast down the mighty from their thrones and lifted up the lowly. You have filled the hungry with good things and the rich you have sent away empty-handed. You have come to the help of your servant Israel, for you have remembered your promise of mercy. Magnificat anima mea dominum, the promise that you made to our ancestors, to Abraham and Sarah and their children forever. Glory to you, source of all being eternal worth and Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Magnificat anima mea dominum. Bless Yahweh, my soul. And may the God of hope fill us with all joy and peace in believing through the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia.